Okay, I'm finally back on doing Panorama. <sighs> it's been a while. <laughs> so I have decided to split this up into more parts than I was. Because I realized I, there's a lot more details than I had originally planned for. But today we're going to be doing this part from down here including the windows and stuff here to the back back here which will include these pillars and the funnel and all that but in order for us to get started we're going to start with the funnel which I've set up over here so you're going to come to this uh, building area right here come to the middle block and then skip two then you're gonna come up by two right here and you're gonna come up one two three four five six twos and then you're gonna have three coming out and two connected in the back so three then one two then put one on top of that two and have four right here on the side of that one block at the front, one black over, or block over the back. <clears throat> and place one on top of that one that's here. Make it two and have one here. And then you're going to come up by one, back by two. You have a one here, two here, two there, one and two. You don't have to worry about this part. So I'll go over that again. So up by one, then a two, one, two, two, one, two. Then come back to this one right here, next to the first two. Come up by two on top of that. Then two here, two here, and two here. So four sets of two right there. Then come to this second to last two have one in the first block then have two and one so it'll create this shape at the end which will set us up for the finishing layers up here okay so we're going to start here layer number one you obviously have your two blocks here and then you make this three wide and then have two coming this way <coughs> Then a one, three, then an eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now we need to get out all our white but to make sure I get the right block. Look over here. We're using smooth ports, okay? So we're gonna have five here. One, two, three, four, five. Then in blue. One, two, three, one. And back up here, you have your one, and a two, and a two, and then a three, and then seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then five, one, two, three, four, five, and blue, one, two, three, four, and one, two. And then back up here again. You're going to have three across, and then two this way, one, three, <clears throat> and then a six, one, two, three, four, five, six, and then four, one, two, three, four, and another four, one, two, three, four, then four, one, two, three, four, oops, four, and then one, one and another five five across the back <laughs> one two three four five and then back up here you're gonna have two sets of two after that one then a three then a six one two three four five six 
then three right here, then five, one, two, three, four, five, then a three, three sets of one, one, two, and three, and then three across the middle box right here. There we go. Hold on just a second. Okay, there we go. Sorry. <laughs> so back here again. This is gonna be three wide. Then you have a two. Then a one. Then a three. And a five. One, two, three, four, five. Then two here. And then five. One, two, three, four, five. Then a four. Then a one, two, and then three. One, two, three. Back up here again. This time we're gonna have two more twos after. This block, anyways. So two, two, and then four, two, three, four, and another four, two, two three, four. Then your two and four blues, one, two, three, four. And then another four and two, three, four. And then one, one, two across, and one. So there's the middle. Then this one's going to be three again. And then a two. You know, one, one, two, three, four, five. And two here, two white. And then three blues. Then come in by five, one, two, three, four, five. And one, two, and three. And that's across the middle. And then back up here again. You're gonna have your two sets of two after this again. And then a seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two white. And then seven blue, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then a one, one, two. And one here. Okay, back up here, make this three. Then have a two, and a one, and a six. One, two, three, four, five, six, two. Then six blue. One, two, three, four, five, six. Three sets of one, one, two, three. And then three across the back. Then up here. We have one, and then this time only one, two, then two sets of one, and then a five, one, two, three, four, five, two white, and five blue, one, two, three, four, five, then two, one, two across, and one. Then make this three wide up here. Have two sets of one. Then two, three, two white. Three blue. Three in. One, one, and three. Okay. Back up to the front again from this block right here. This is gonna turn into four sets of one. So one, two, three, four. And then a four, one, two, three, four. Two white. And then five blue, one, two, three, four, five. Two in, two across, and one here. Okay. 
Now this one starts right here. So you have your three, one, two, three, and then your one, and then another one, and then a two, and then a three, two white, and then four blue, one, two, three, four, and then two in, one, and then a three across here. <coughs> Okay, this one starts from this block. So you have your gap right here. Look at there. This is where it starts. You have your four. One, two, three, four. Then have a one. Then a four. One, two, three, four. Two. And five. One, two, three, four, five. And then three sets of one. One, two, three. Then this next one starts right here. One, two. Then two, then one. Now you're gonna have two this way. And then another two this way as well. Then three connected to it. One, two, three. Then another three. Two white here. Then one blue. Then come back in one. Then have two this way. One and two here. Okay. Hold on. Oh, wait. Okay. So we hit it right. What is two this way? No, I didn't write that down right. <laughs> Okay, so it looks like that. Don't worry about this, we'll fill it in later. So come back here to this block. You had your one right here. Then you had your one, two, one, two, two, one, and then two here. Come to the back of it. You're going to have four connected to the back. Two, three, four. In total, four. And then two white. Three blue. One, two, three. Now you're going to have six connected to this block. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then four coming in. One, two, three, four. Then a two here. One here and one there. And with that, I believe it's... Yeah, we'll take care of that later. Okay. So just leave it like this. You have this gap right here, but it'll be fixed in a little bit. So come here to this block. Or these two, one, two. You're going to have four sets of two. One, two, three, four. Then grab your light gray. And you're going to have nine from here. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then have one here. And make that three. And then two right there. I think that's how that ends. Yep, that's how it ends. Okay. This is looking a bit weird, I thought. It'll fix itself in a little bit. Okay, so here, come here, one, two, one. This one right here is going to turn into a four, two, three, four, and then a two, and then three blue, one, two, three, and make that a two. So that is the layers for that part. Now we're going to come and do the in inside layers, pretty much. So we're going to start here at this block, make this a 3, and have a 3 coming in, then 2 whites coming out, 3 blue behind it, 1, 2, 3, 
and then three coming in connected here. So one, two, three, like that. Then come to this block right here. This one right here turns into a four. Then have a two. Then two white, then one blue. And then two sets of two. Connecting it to this one right here. And then we're going to come to this block right here. You have three. Then have another three. Two white. And then three. Or no, wait. Hold on. Oh, the three. Okay, it comes in. Oh, great. So you had your three reds, three reds, two blues, and then this one right here is going to be three. And then for this top one, fill it in. So it's looking like that. Now we have to figure out what the light does. I was going to to write this part down. So let's see. This one's a two, three, two. So this one right here. One, two, three. So you can now fill this part in, as well as the front section, like that. And you can fill this block in here. Okay. Now this one. That's easy. So this one right here. Let's extend it to the wall. Or no. Build it back by one, then extend it the wall. So it looks like this. And then fill in your red and your blue at the back. So that's the top half looks. Obviously, you have to fill this part. So let's go take a look at that. So it's a two, then a three, two, three. Two, three, two, three. That's a odd looking shape. So I have a two here, and then a three. One, two, and then a three. I know that looks weird, but it's fine. Fill this in. And then this back piece has a little bit of a fix to it. So it's across that block, okay. So right here, one there, one there, and one here. So it looks like that. So that's how the top looks. Let's see if I need to do anything else to the top. Nope, that's how it should look. Now we have to do this part real quick. So, I don't know where to start with this part. See, so is the bottom already set up? Hmm. No, yeah, it is. That's easy. Okay, cool. So, this one right here is 3, 3. So, we can do that first part. So, come down here. We're going to have 1, 2, and a 3. And 3 there. So fill in your lights. Uh, it's kind of weird. Mm -hmm. Okay, there we go. That's why. <laughs> so fill in your blues. Then your reds. So it looks like that. I wasn't able to write this part down as well, so we're gonna have a two and then a little four. So then the two right there, four here, fill in your red in front of that, and your blue behind that. So that is the funnel. 
obviously was confusing, so I'll let you see from the top. I can also place down some glass, so you can count blocks. Might make it a little bit easier. So that's a four or seven if you count the other side. Then you have the other side down here, which we just had to fill it in pretty much. That's the only difference. And there's the other star, uh, I don't know, funnel stand books or whatever you want to call it. There we go. So I can give you a look at the other side as well. So this is how it will look, minus the black box. And the other side looks like that. Of course, minus the black box again. So there we go. Okay. So now I'll be right back. I'm going to go figure out how to do this part right here. So I'll be back for a second. Okay, come back here to this little area on this little thing. Build each corner up by four. One, two, three, four. This corner, this corner, and then these two. Then you're going to make this block right here. You're going to make it 13 total, including this one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Do the same thing over here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Then connect it to. And then fill every other one with glass. And alternate them with the quartz blocks. Okay, there we go. So it looks like that. Let's get to one, two, three, and then three by three box that connects to the top. So one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Make it three tall. And connect it across the front. But only the top block. Leave it just goes to the back. Yeah, that's so go to the back and connect it down here. Same with this side. So it looks like this. Okay. Now let's do this little back area. So it extends six out. And then it's seven long, okay. So back here, one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And connect it. And do your glass pattern again. Then you're gonna fill in right here. And right here, that's pillars. Okay. Then this one, the one, is going to be two and a one. So right here, two, one. Two, one. And have two and one here. I believe it's two and one. Yeah, it is. Okay. So that building's done. Okay, no. 
Now let's do these pieces. Let's get three, or three, and then connect it up. So right here, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then connect it to the top. Same thing over here, one, two, three, one, two, three, and connect it up. Now let's place down the television screen right here. So this is 13 wide, and it goes down by 7 on each side. So one, one extending on each side right here, and connect it to, should be 13, it is. Then drop it down by 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. Do the same thing over here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Then connect this one to the other side. Skip one here. Then get out your... Um, what wall do we use here? I don't remember. No, dior dioride wall, okay? So obviously if you're not in the new version, just use something else here. But we just skip two. And then we fill the screen in with black bolt. So that's how that part looks. Okay. Hmm. Now the last part, not for now, oh no, for this video, but for now is to set up the side pieces. So let's see. Hmm. It's a good way to do this. Set up this first one. It's gonna be eight from that block. And three up and five up. Okay. So come here to this block. Let's get eight. Then have one here that goes up by three and five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Then you're gonna skip. 9, and then 3, 3, and then 2. So we we'll skip 9 from that block. 1, 2, 3, or no, 3, 3, and 2. And I believe the rest of them down the side are the same. I just have to check. It's in the same width between each other. So far they are. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This last one's 10. So we'll have to change that one. So it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 seven of those so seven of these so just keep skipping nine and building that same pattern so one two three one two three and two and just continue doing that one two three one two three and two one two three and two. One, two, three, two, three, and two. One, two, three, two, three, and two again. Okay. 
and this is the last one. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven of those. And then if I remember this last one ends up being 10 with a 35 pattern as before. So skip 10 right here. And then have your three and a five, two, four, five, like that. Hmm. Okay, so this bottom one goes all the way straight. Okay, so get out your diorite right wall. Come to this block right here. And make it straight throughout these. So connect it there. And it there. And continue going all the way to the front. one is straight except for the first and last one so come to this one right here and make the top one all the way to the back except for the last one if I could actually do this right one more Okay, for the back, it's going to be 7 and then 3, connect them inside. So, 1, 2, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 1, 2, 3, and then this side, it's going to be 5 and then 4. So one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four. Now we connect it, it's gonna be four and five on the bottom. So here, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five. And this top one's gonna be one to the outside. So one short of the last one. So it looks like that. If you want the real numbers, it'll be three, four, including that one, and then six there. Okay. So that's the front connected and the side is done. Now to do, do the back real quick. Let's find out where these pillars are. There is none. Okay. So this one right here is going to be five. So one, two, three, four, five. Over here. One, two, three, four. Over there. And these connect to the other side. So the mine aren't going to connect, but they'll connect over there if you build the other side. So they'll look like that. Okay. Now let's build these little thingies right here. So let's skip one corner and have two. So let's skip one here, one, two, and make a plus, and an eye on top, and another plus. Same thing over here, one, two, plus, and then a nine, and then another plus. So that's a simple little thing. Now we're gonna build this little structure right here. But I'm gonna copy this thing and move it to the ground. 
so you can see how the floor looks. Let's just copy it from this spot. Okay. So you're going to start Let's undo that. It's kind of hard to explain it that way. So you're going to start skipping one block from here. And go to four there. And skip four for the entrance on each side. And then skip three in between. Okay. So come here, skip one. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Then skip four. One, two, three, four. Skip three. Oops, that's a two. That's another two. And build this up. Then put one coming in. And then have five coming to the other side. So one, two, three, four, five. 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 And we'll do the same thing over here. And bring it back down. Now for the floor, you're going to break this, place it with your cords, and there's an entrance on both sides, I think. Yeah. So just skip one on those. So on the entrances, put one here, one there, and then break the floor for the rest. Here, one there, and connect it to there. Oops, those two need to fill up with one. There we go. So it looks like that. Now let's go get our iron bars. And we're just going to fill that in and leave room for the doors. So one, two, and come across. If I can place it right. And one, two, and across here. And across this part. And then for this one, fill it up completely. And then across here. And then over here as well. So it's looking like that. So continue doing this. Sides, it's just completely filled up. Oh, 
Okay, since I don't have too much time, I obviously won't go to do the rest, but continue this, filling it all the way down, including your doors down here, doors here, and just fill this piece in. And then fill these in, fill the roof in, fill this other side. And that'll be the basketball area. Now I'm going to copy the court design to the ground so you can see it without having all the bars in the way. We'll copy it from here. I'm not going to show you how to build this part, so I'm just going to let you see it. So, if you would look at it, this will be your first pillar, and then your second, then another one here, and here, or not here. This will be your entrance. This will all be filled in. Your other entrance. Then your seal three. And then one of these corners. So it looks like that is the main design. Of course, you'll fill these in. These are going to be your doors. Then you fill these in. here so that is the court design I can uh, place a block of glass on top of the white so you can count it I filled the floor with spruce planks I can put black glass so you can see from the side how much it is. And here, just know that'll be three. So hopefully you can see that. So from the side, we can just start here. So you can start it from the middle of that seven on the side. You can make the core design from the pillars if you wanted to, or you could just change it up completely. In the middle, that's at three, that blue. Just remember that. I'll let you see it for a couple more seconds. Okay, so let me get rid of this. I'll leave that down there though. So you can see it again without all that stuff in the way. Hopefully you don't need to count the blocks or anything, but that's how that looks. I will leave some pictures if you need it in the Discord if you want me to. Just let me know. Go over there and talk to me and I'll post it. Okay. Now we're just going to set up this. Not we're going to... Um, can't even talk. Get out your cyan and your lime concrete. So it's going to be two, two, and two. So come here. I have two right there, two here, and two there. And then connect this to the end section right to there. One block short. And then break these and connect it. And then the front. It's going to be one and then one. One and one. 
And for the lime, it's going to be one, two, three, four, five, two, and two. So here, one, two, three, four, five, two, and two. Then just click this and fill it in. But don't break the cyan, so it ends there. Then the front of this is all going to be cyan. This row right here is going to be in line, though. Now you can replace all this to the other side, just being all lime wool, or lime concrete, should I say, through here. And then to the other side, obviously. So once you fill it all in, it will look like this without all the golf course areas. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is once again, I'm not going to build this area, but I'm going to use glass to let you see where everything goes. And I'll put glass on top of this. So come to this corner, three, and then one is soy. These are prismarine brick slabs. So you put three here, three there, two there, four here, two, one, one, two, one, one. Yellow here, yellow there. And then right here, I put another brick slab down there to represent the hole. So that's the first one. Then you can place random umbrellas across, which I did. And then just skip two from this block to the two. Then you're going to have one here, two facing that way, four facing that way, three coming this way, three that way, three that way, and one here. Your hole right there. And some yellow and yellow right there. Then skip four, one, two, three, four. Up slab there, and there's the design. And there's your yellow as well. So two here, two there, and two there. And then have one diagonal. And there's the design for that one. And then have three in between those. And this one just goes five and then two past the pillar. And three, two, and five with the whole bill. Now the same the other side's the same thing. So if we just put one, two, three, one, one, two, one, two, three, four. And then one, and then one, and then like that. So it's all the same on the other side. So if you only use a little bit of side, the other side will be flipped. So I'm not going to actually build that though. So you can design your own course, or you can just use the glass that I just told you to let you see it. But I'm going to show you each one. So there's this one. Then the glass follows, and it looks like this. And then this one. This one. And this one. And then you've got your random umbrellas across the area that are not in the course. So like one here, one there, one there. Those don't matter as much, so place those wherever you want. So now that part's done, not done over here, but that's how it should look. And the basketball court area is done. Hold on. 49 minutes, okay. 
So we've got time to decorate this little bottom area to finish off the build for this part. So give me just a minute. I'm going to fix this up real quick and make it look better. I'll be right back in just a second. Okay, so I decided for the rest of this, I'm not going to build it over there. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to show you. So we built this one, which is this one over there. It drops down below. So as you can see, it just comes down to this floor down here, or the support beam. And then the same thing goes for this one. So three down here. And then this one just connects down. This one does as well. So it just connects down like that. Then this last one does that as well. Okay. So now we can set up this um, area, should I say. So leave these pillars out, that's for the next part. But I have stairs here, three, two on each side. Then the door in here to go inside. Then a little chair right there, three here. Then a four window piece right there, skip two, the door. Should be one block to this pillar. One block, then another window, skip one, a bench, skip one again, then your window, and it should be two from the end. Another one, one, then your door, skip two, just two pieces of glass this time, skip three, then another two, and then skip two and your door, and skip two, and you'll have this one here. Then skip three for the or, uh, skip four. So pretend like that one's empty. Yeah, this one is empty as well. So it'll be 19 glasses in all. So skip four, have 19. And then break this block, make it one for this side. And one longer on the back. So from there to here it should be 19, and from there to here it should be 19. And then from the top block, skip not 8, and it will be at your pillar. And then the back is completely blank. And by 8, I mean it'll be at this corner, right here. And then over here, I have a little bench right here, skip two. And that is pretty much it for this part. Skip four right here, another bench. And then you want to put your glass, your glass panes over here. And of course on this layer right here. And the glass just ends right there, and then you can also cover this part if you want. And then for the name, if you want to do that part real quick, um, come to the store if you built it. It should be after this window. Come to this block, and then just come right out. And then build it down by 19. Then you just use your banner letters and build carnival pan panorama. Skipping one in between each so it looks like that. And this one should come back to this block on the glass right there. So that's how it looks. So it should look like this whenever it's detailed, if you did all of it, including the golf course and the glass stuff and that. And this part right here, the name. 
We'll do this part later, so don't worry about that. This is how it should look. Full detailed and everything else. Forget, don't worry about the webs and all that yet. But that is how this part should be done. So that's the end of, I don't even remember. Uh, let me look. Part seven, maybe. Part seven, yeah. So this was part seven, so I'll be back for part eight pretty soon. I hope you all enjoyed. I will see you all next time. Remember to join the Discord or my Instagram if you would like to. I will be answering questions there and all that if I needed to. So be there and I will help you out if you need it. Other than that, I'll see you all next time. Thank you for watching.